Citizen Farm is an urban farming model that we have created to fit the needs of Singapore. Implementing an urban farm within a city, using what the city and an urbanised area has, such as food waste, and turning it into an agricultural input, such as fertiliser and animal feed, that we can pump into an urban farm that will then use that agricultural input and turn it into a product that we sell back into the community again. What we do in our farm, we harness the power of nature through a very humble insect called the black soldier fly. And the black soldier fly has an appetite like no other insect, where they can eat up to four times their weight a day. So if I have one ton of this insect, I'll need four tons of food waste just to keep them happy. And more importantly, as the insect eats the food waste, it generates its own waste, which can then use to turn into compost for the vegetables and flowers to grow. The technology helps us create a new system that can be fit in small environment and closed environment because in cities this is more or less what we have. We have no soil, we have no space. A controlled environment where you have plants growing under the conditions that it should grow in. We try to use the full spectrum of the sun but in different quantities because we know that the plants prefer just the blue and red so we tweak the ratios of the light spectrum to suit the plant's needs. We get very consistent growth and we get very high quality vegetables that are filled with the good fresh nutrients that we need. With the help of the grant money, we are now able to build a new urban farming concept called City Farm. City Farm is a three-storey high container farming unit that brings about the elements of citizen farm, such as the insect, the mushroom and the vegetables, to be farmed inside containers. So this city farm model is highly, highly concentrated because it has a smaller footprint, so we can fit into food courts, supermarkets, wet markets, hawker centres. We are able to take in the food waste and at the same time deliver and produce freshly grown and freshly harvested vegetables for the community again. This is a very, very scalable model that requires very little energy to turn products that we don't want into products that we want. The entire ecosystem needs to be in sync for such a movement to become a reality.